Hey guys, so today, well, hi guys, I'm Jade, and today we will be doing what you all been waiting for, weekly reviews. Bum bum, bum bum. Yep, uh, so every week I review stuff for you guys. I'm hoping I can make new series. I have some new things to tell about, which is going to be uploaded in my update video, which should be updated at the same time as this video. So yeah, we're going to get started. So I already have a tip on, so sorry. But today I'm reviewing the Tony Moly Petite Bunny Lip Bar. <coughs> sorry, got something stuck in my head. And this is pocket sized. It's pretty much size of your outside. And I got, I forgot what kind of got, it's like orange something. I'm not sure guys, I'm sorry. I'm not very professional, I can see. Let's see. Let me just put this on, it's bugging me. Um, so this is what it looks like. That's what the cap looks like. I love that there's this that's so long. I love that. It's so unique in the brand that they have that. It's so cool too. The color is more corally pink, and I love it so much. I wish the color was actually the color, because it's not. It's really off. And it has an angry face. Like, you could see the bunny. He has little ears. So then there's, like, this little tab. So there's, like, a little Korean. And then on, there's a little tab that should be sealed. If it's not, then you don't, don't use it. And it, I agree, and it should just have a bunch of Korean. That probably tells you, but I don't know. Um, so when you pop it open, I love that the cap is so long, so you can leave it extended out. So when I first saw this, I was like, oh my god, what is this? It looks like a melted orange gram with some glitter in it. Not even edible glitter, it's glitter. It looked terrible, but it's, I'm going to swatch it for you, but it's not, actually. So this is what it looks like when it comes out. Should you see that? And look at that orange, though. Look at that orange, though. That's, like, orange. And it might not, sh might, might not show up on camera because you can hardly see them, really. But there are fragments, like, there is glitter in here, like, a good amount of glitter. I'm going to swatch it for you. And it's orange. It's radish orange, and I really like the color. When you do swatch the color, and this can go up a lot without hitting the cap, which is what I like. It does end up kind of doing this color. Like, it ends up looking a little more orangey than this color, but it's still really close, which made me really excited when I swatched it. 10 out of 10 would recommend this product. It shipped fairly quick. It actually was exactly on time with when it said it was shipping. And this was like $5, I think. $5. But it's really cute, and I definitely think it's worth buying. Pros and cons about this item. It is very cute. I like that a lot. Um, so The con about this item is that it looks like a crayon. Literally, it doesn't look like a crayon from the outside, but when you take it out, it's not a crayon, by the way, I guess, but, like, that's, doesn't it kind of look like crayon? It doesn't look like crayon when it came out. And it's very nourishing, very smooth. It's not streaky, which is something that happens a lot in glosses and mattes. And I felt when I put this on, it actually started to turn, like, matte. And I was really surprised, and I was like, whoa, it's drying. It's turning matte. I was so nervous, and I think that's a pro. It's so cool. Oh, smell-wise, I like it a lot. Smell-wise, it's probably the best smell I've ever smelled. I know that is, like, so weird, but it is. It smells so good, guys. I would definitely recommend the smell. It's very faint, too. Like, you really have to get your nose up smelling it, and then you can smell it. Take it right off my face. Okay. Um, so... This was Jade. I hope you guys liked my video. Do all your YouTube things. Like, comment, subscribe, and like this video. 
comment down below what's your favorite color. Mine's obviously blue. Bye, guys.